2018 was awesome. 2022, not awesome. Wish I could turn that screen off so I'd stop looking up there in victory lane. Uh, it's close, man. It's close. I really thought we had it. You know, firing off that last restart, really two restarts to go. I just had that confidence, you know. Uh, just didn't get it done. But proud of everybody on our McDonald's Toyota Camry team. Uh, you know, our family stuff's been strong. Even with this next gen car, it shows the caliber of people that we have at our shop to continue to build this stuff. So it's going to get a little bit better. Have some Toyota help at the end. Yeah, what'd you need at the end? Yeah, Toyota help for sure. Uh, I know they got taken out early in the race. Kyle was there, but we just couldn't get last stuff together. So uh, it is what it is. We'll uh, continue to build off this and go into California and be good. You said this would hurt worse than the first time. Oh, no doubt. No doubt. I was a rookie. didn't know what I was doing. Uh, fighting with the boss man now, uh, Denny. And I was just a wreck. I was an emotional wreck. And uh, just, gosh, you know, it's, this one, being that close, I didn't, have a, I didn't have a fighting chance in the first time in 2018. This one being that close, it's just like a gut punch. So going from all the confidence in the world to literally having it ripped out from underneath you is a really shitty feeling. Yeah, yeah, it, it's part of it. It's motorsports, so it's sports. That's what happens. By the motion there, uh, you're getting out of the car. Your thoughts are, uh, I mean, just kind of go through that. And, and, Sad. The feeling of dejection and failure. You know, we succeeded. We succeeded on all levels. But we failed at the same time. And so going through that, trying to hide that is super tough. And, and uh, you know, maybe two days, maybe three, probably a freaking week I'll get over this. Uh, but California Sunday, that's the one thing that people ask me about, you know, what motivates you? Just having another chance next week to go back and get some nights. Yeah, he still would have won by the time we hit. Yeah, he would have crossed the line. So, uh, just thank you. What else could you do when you were watching the replay on the video board? What, what did you feel like? Yeah, I just hadn't seen the replay. Yeah, he's still would have won by the time we hit. Yeah, he would have crossed the line. So, uh, what else could you do? It don't matter what I do, though. It don't matter if I give everybody a million bucks. What did you what think of the new car? Were you so big? I mean, was it yeah, so I, different? I, I mean, what, what was that At the end of the day, it's a race car. Um, I, I actually enjoyed being behind the wheel, learning a lot. Uh, the track is a little bit different. The pushing is a little bit different. Um, so some things that we need to work on. We can, you know, enhance our speed in certain areas. So, be a good debrief tomorrow. So we'll just talk about it, try to get better. The last race one. Had that support help from you guys, but you guys were not working on the race. You know, you the last green uh, at the beginning, I was like, this ain't bad. And then we had some moments. And I was like, all right, let's, let's not let it go. Kyle's the best at pushing. So I was really good chance to try to move the line. And and it's always interesting being pushed. The last green flag, do you have a plan in your head? Did it work? Did it? No, my plan was to go do a burnout. <laughs> <laughs> go uh, have a few beverages after to celebrate with family and not go home and uh, yeah figure out how to get hell how the hell to get to California uh, hungover probably but I'll be sober and it's sad. <laughs> you said you'd rather wreck than finish second earlier. Can you tell us why? Yeah, finishing like that it's like hell we should have wrecked. Because I think I'd have been like oh damn it's Daytona instead of being like. I hate they told me right now because I finished second like that, so it is what it is. Going yeah. to that last restart, though, having Ryan there. You know what the deal was? Uh, that you almost had it, right? You almost had it. Mm -hmm. And? Uh, I mean, I'm happy. We ran well. I just hate it. We get that close. So I just look away from it. Nothing to do. Damage on the car. A little bit of damage on the car. Yeah. Fortunate, though, we knew where two to go. You're going to be so packed up. You know that. Still had a, a great shot. So. They say you gotta get to a couple of big ones before you can win this one. Yeah, but I don't do it. <laughs>
who knows? What do you make of the racing? I thought it was good. I thought I thought for all the stuff everybody's gone through and uh, you know, getting here and whatever, I thought it was a good show. What'd you think? It was pretty intense and there were lots of storylines and we breaking it down for a whole week. Yeah, I thought so too. I thought we put on a great show. Anyway, Bubba did great. Thank McDonald's and Joya. Appreciate it. Thank you, man. Booty, what's the feeling like just being helpless on the box? Because at that point, your driver's just doing his thing and you got no control. That's pretty much it. But, I mean, we, we as a team had to put him in position. He and Freddie did exceptional to, uh, you know, try to execute. They did. So, it was close. Had tears in his eyes on pit road. That just shows how much it means to him. Oh, yeah, sure. He wanted it as much as all of us did.